How are you, Prep 2? Welcome to our second term. Let's start with algebra lessons. Unit 1, talking about factorization. We have seven lessons talking about factorization. The first lesson is called factorizing trinomials. Let's remember we studied before that factorizing an integer means to write it as a product of two factors or more. For example, we can factorize 16 to 16 times 1 or 16 times 2 or 16 to equal negative 2 times negative 8 or 16 equal 4 times 4 or 2 times 2 times 4 or we factorize 2 by multiplying 2 4 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2. Factorizing an algebraic expression means to write it as a product of two factors or more. Also, we have learned before to factorize by taking out the highest common factor, which is called HCF. How can factorize an expression by taking out the highest common factor? The first step determines the highest common factor of the terms of the algebraic expression. Second, put the highest common factor outside the two arcs. Then divide each term of the algebraic expression by the highest common factor and put the quotient inside the arc. For example, Factorize each of the following, taking out the highest common factor. Number one, 5a plus 15b. The highest common factor here is 5. So, when we divide 5a by plus 15b by 5, we get a plus 3b. Number two, 10xy minus 8xz. The highest common factor here is 2x. So, when we divide 10xy minus 8xz by 2x, we get 5y minus 4z. Number 3, the highest common factor will be 4x. We write 4x outside the two arcs. And divide each two term by 4x, we get 3x minus y. 3x power 2 plus y plus 2xy power 2 minus xz. The highest common factor here is xy. Divide each term by xy, we get 3x plus 2y minus 1. Let's be talking about factorize quadratic trinomial in the form x power 2 plus px plus c. From our studying of multiplying by inspection, we know that x plus 2 times x plus 4 equal x power 2 plus 6x plus 8. We note that the last term, 8, is the product of 2 times 4, and the coefficient of x is the sum of 2 plus 4. The expression x power 2 plus 6x plus 8 is called the trinomial because it consists of three terms. The trinomial which is in the form x power 2 plus px plus c is factorized to two factors. The first term in each factor is x. The two other terms in the two factors are two numbers whose product is c, lower the last term in the trinomial, and their sum is b, lower coefficient of x in the trinomial. For example, factorize each of the following. Number one, x power two plus five x plus six. We will open two brackets and write x in each bracket. Then we search for two numbers, their product equal six and their sum equal five. We get them 2 and 3, so x power 2 plus 5x plus 6 equal x plus 2 times x plus 3. لو خدت بالك هتلاقي ان البرودكت بوزيتيف والسم كمان كان بوزيتيف يبقى التو نمبرز لازم يكونوا هما الاثنين بوزيتيف زي ما احنا شايفين كده ان التو اركس هاف ذا سيم ساين اللي هي البوزيتيف. نمبر 2 x power 2 minus 5x plus 6 we will search for two numbers, their product equal six and their sum equal negative five. 
we get them negative 2 and negative 3 then x power 2 minus 5x plus 6 equal x minus 2 times x minus 3 we notice that the product is positive and the sum is negative then the two numbers are negative together x power 2 plus 5x minus 6 number 3 I search for two numbers whose product is negative 6 and their sum positive 5. We get them 6 and negative 1. If x power 2 plus 5x minus 6 equal x plus 6 or x minus 1. If the product is negative, if two numbers have the different sign, the sum is positive, the great number will have the same sign and the other is negative. x power 2 minus 5x minus 6, we will search for two numbers, their product equal 6, and their sum equal negative 5. We will get negative 6 and positive 1, because negative 6 times 1 equal negative 6, and negative 6 plus 1 equal negative 5. If a sense the product is negative, since the two numbers have a different sign. Since the sum is negative, if a greatest number is negative and the other is positive. From the previous example, we note that when we factorize trinomial x power 2 plus px plus c in the form x plus l and x plus m, then if c is positive, if a product of the two numbers is positive, that means L and M have the same sign as B. If C is negative, the product of the two numbers is negative. Then L and M have a different sign, such that the great one have the same sign as B. Complete each of the following x power 2 minus 11x plus 18. We factorize x power 2 to x times x. Now I want to factorize 18 to two numbers. Their product equal positive 18 and their sum equal negative 11. We get 9 times 2. And the two numbers have negative. x power 2 plus 5x plus 6 equal dot times x plus 2. We have one of the factors and I want to get the other factor. We factorize x power 2 to x times x and 6 is 3 times 2. x minus naught is a factor of the expression x power 2 minus x minus 6. This expression to be factorized will be factorized to x x and the 6 will factorize 3 or 2 and the greatest one will have the sign of the coefficient of x if I will negative if x plus 2y equal 4 and x minus y equal 1 then the numerical value of the expression of the expression x power 2 plus xy minus 2y power 2 is the product of the two numbers. If we factorize this expression, we will get x to x, y to y, 2y positive and y is negative. If a four times one equal four. Number five, the rectangle whose area is x power two minus seven x plus six square unit. And if its length is x minus six, then its width will be. Factorize x power 2 minus 7x plus, 7 plus 6 will be factorized to x to x and 6 1 when the two numbers will be negative if a weights will be x minus 1. Question number 6, the only x power 2 plus no up plus 35 equal x plus no up plus no up times 5. Top on x will be factorized x times x. And 35 will be factorized 7 times 5. And the middle term here will be 7x plus 5x equal 12x. 
if x minus 2 is a factor of the expression x power 2 minus 8 x plus 12 then the other factor is Factorize x power 2 minus 8x plus 12 into two factors. 12 will be factorized to 6 times 2 because the sum will be 8. Give us the other factor in x minus 6. If a minus b equal 1 and x plus y equal negative 3, then a times x plus y minus b times x plus y equal. By taking x plus y as a common factor, we get a minus b. So, 1 times 3 equal negative 3. If x minus 4 is a factor of the expression x power 2 minus 5 x plus 4, then the other factor will be x minus 1. x power 2 plus dot plus 8 equal x plus 2. We will factorize x to x times x and then 8 2 times 4, then the middle term will be 2x plus 4x equal 6x. Another question shows the correct answer. Number 1, if a minus b equals 3, then 6a minus 6b will be, and after the 6 common, you have a 6 times 3 equal 18. The expression x power 2 minus x minus a can be factorized if a, I want to get number from this choice, can be factorized will be 6 because 6 is factorized to two numbers their product equals 6 and their difference the difference between them equal negative 1 if x power 2 minus 2x minus k equal x plus 3 times x minus 5 then k equal 15 the expression x power 2 minus 3x plus c can be factorized when c equal I want to get a number can be factorized to two numbers their product is c and their sum equal 3 we will choose 2 because 2 times 1 equal 2 and 2 plus 1 equal 3 if the expression x power 2 plus bx minus 10 can be factorized then b will be 3 because 10 can factorize to 2 3 times to 2 times 5 and 5 minus 2 equal 3 the number which can be added to the expression x power 2 minus 11 x plus 15 to be factorized is in numbers which can be add اللي ممكن اعمل له add لل expression ده علشان نقدر نعمل له factorize the 15 طبعا if we want to Factorize 15 to two numbers, the product is 15 and their sum equal 11. There is no, no number, their sum equal 11. So I will want to add number to 15. I will add 3 to get 18 because 18 can be factorized to two numbers, their sum equal 11, like 9 times 2. If x minus y equal 3 and x minus 2y equal 5, you have x power 2 minus 3xy plus 2y power 2 equal 3 times 5 equals 15. The expression x power 2 plus 7x plus a can be factorized if a equals 10. The for the expression x power 2 minus x minus k can be factorized, then k doesn't equal 8 because 8 factorized to 2 times 4 or 8 times 1 and in the two cases the difference will be not 1 if the expression x power 2 plus ax plus 2 can factorize then a may be 3 because 2 plus 1 equals 3 another example factorize each of the following perfectly x power 2 plus 11x plus 10, we will open two brackets and write x to x. With 10 factorized to 10 times 1. So x power 2 minus 7x plus 12, we will factorize x to x, 
12 3 times 4 and the two brackets will be negative and their sum equal negative 7. Question number 3, x power 2 plus 5x minus 14, factorize two brackets, x x, factorize 14 to 7 times 2, the greatest number will get the sign of 5 positive and the other bracket will have negative. x power 2 plus 4x minus 12, open two bracket and we write x to x, factorize 12 to 2 times 6 because the difference between 6 to 2 equals 4. The greatest number will have the sign of the middle term and the other bracket have the other sign. Number 5, x power 2 plus 8x plus 15. Open two bracket, x to x, factorize 15 to 3 times 5, their sum equal 8. Number 6, x power 2 minus 17x plus 30, factorize x power 2 to x times x, and 30, 15 times 2, because 15 plus 2 equals 17, and the two brackets have the same sign of the middle term. Open two brackets and factorize x power 2 to x times x and factorize 16 to 8 times 2 and difference between them will be 6. The greatest number have the sign of the middle term and the other bracket have the inverse sign. You have an 8 be negative with 2 be positive. x power 2 minus 7xy minus 18y power 2. Factorize x power 2 to x times x and 18. Factorize to 2 times 9. You have a 2y minus 9y. Number 9, x power 2 plus 21 minus 10x. At the first arrange, your trinomial is x power 2 minus 10x plus 21. Then factorize, open two bracket, x times x. 21 factorized to 3 times 1, their sum equal 10. And have the same sign of the middle term negative. x times x of x power 2 plus 7x plus 10. Then factorize, x for x, 10 2 times 5, their sum equal 10.